Okay, I'm going to show you how to change the expiratory valve and membrane on a Hamilton ventilator. If I just turn the ventilator to the side, I have the inspiratory port, the flow sensor connections, and here is the expiratory port, which is an integral part of the expiratory valve. If I take the valve and then click to the left, that releases the valve, then I can pull out. This is the valve, which will then go to the container for the technicians to take to CSSD for cleaning. They will collect it and put it back together again. However, if you find a valve that is in its component parts, you will have a membrane and the valve. The membrane has a rim here, which fits on top of the rim of the expiratory valve. However, the technicians should be putting these back together, so when you collect a valve, it should be ready to go. To put back into the ventilator, we just make sure that the port is downwards and then push into the ventilator, click to the right.